we have seen you guys discussing a move to the farm. And I know there's been debates whether that's the right move, literally, for your family. Have you guys made a decision yet? There's a lot of moving parts and a lot of family and emotions and expectations. We have another season of Little People, Big World. Hey. Hey. Tori, what are you doing here? I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm Tori's distracting I'm freeloading me. and distracting everyone. Yeah, that's exactly what she's doing. <laughs> I'm just here until like people start showing up, then we'll probably head out. What have you been the most excited for that fans have been seeing and will continue to see play out this season? I think so. Yeah, just super excited. Seeing Jackson and Lila kind of grow up has been a really fun as parents for us. Mm -hmm. um, for me, that's like one of my favorite parts of watching the whole show is watching them and their funny nisms or whatever they do. Um, their isms. Yeah, that's been a huge part of it. Uh, Jackson and me do a little camping trip at the very end of the season. That's probably for me a highlight of this last six months, um, which was a lot of fun. And um, yeah, that's what I'm kind of looking forward to. Yeah. Do the kids understand yet that like they are reality TV personalities? <laughs> Definitely not. No, they they definitely like it's I think it's funny because, you know, living in the 21st century, I feel like all kids see themselves on like a phone or like sometimes, you know, wherever they see themselves being recorded. So, you know, honestly, I don't think it's much different to him. He asks, yeah. he calls it his show and he asks his, yeah. to watch his, his favorite show, show and... is his show. He knows every character. He knows. Char and it's Grandpa, not called Little People Big Mimi. World. It's called Roll Off Farm. Yeah, he like, says, I want to watch Roll Off Farm. My yeah. show. Yeah. So he and you know, so it's kind of fun for him to watch. And we don't we don't watch all of it with him, but like he gets a trip when it's you know him and his sister and mom and dad and yeah. grandpa. And, yeah, I feel I feel a spinoff coming one day for our oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> he can get his own show. <laughs> Just we'll just have like forty five minutes of just Jackson. That, yeah. I feel like that would be the the best scenario. <laughs> I mean, honestly, the content we all deserve. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, speaking of content, this season so far, we have seen you guys discussing a move to the farm. And I know there's been debates whether that's the right move, literally, for your family. Have you guys made a decision yet? No, no, no decision yet. Um, yeah, we haven't made a decision yet. Just a lot of moving parts and a lot of family and emotions and expectations. So haven't made that decision yet. We're kind of settled where we're at and we're very content here. <laughs> um that was on the table for a minute there um, but just with like the pandemic though too i feel like everything kind of got put on hold and yeah moving to the farm is no exception to that totally understandable i mean the pandemic has uh <laughs> thrown a wrench in a lot of things this past yeah. year but yeah. um we are going to see this season you two celebrating the 10 year anniversary of your first date which is crazy when you hear those words <laughs> 10 year anniversary what comes to mind uh, yeah, it's 10 year anniversary. I love it. I love that stuff. It's crazy how fast it goes. Yeah. Like, it's just crazy. Looking back 10 years, um, only been married for five. So like, and we know- Six, next month. Or six, next <laughs> month, yeah. Six. That's the thing six. about the pandemic. It's, it's gone so fast. Like yeah. I turned 30 in the pandemic and 31, like yeah. two birthdays. Jackson was two when this all started. He's now four, That's wild. you know? Yeah. So yes, yes, we're having our six year anniversary coming up here. Yeah. You know how they say, like, when you know, you know. Was it like that for you guys at the beginning? It was for me. Yeah, Troy but... was, yeah, not for I me. I think Zach, Zach took some convincing. It wasn't, like, convincing. It was just, I was, like, I never dated. I never, I, like, she was my first kiss. Like, it was, I was focused on soccer. And, like, so then I'm, like, all right, I guess I'll, like, let me see. Let me, let's see what this is all about, dating. And then, yeah, then I was, like, all right, one and done. <laughs> Was there a moment, did you end up having a moment later on where you're like, okay, this is the one? Yeah, I, yeah, my moment was more, yeah, just, yeah, like I love Tori and yeah, it was solid. Like, I, yeah, you know, so solid that here we are a decade later, yeah. which is amazing. Congratulations to you guys. The decade together, six years married, two kids. What yeah. would you guys say the secret is to your relationship? Ooh, Tori and me, I feel like we're both pretty good communicators. Um, 
think reflection too is a huge one. Yeah, we reflect a lot together. Well, we have the same similar areas too. Like we're different in a lot of ways, but then also like there's some there's a lot of similarities too. Our like core foundational like personalities are pretty similar. Yeah, we we just see things a lot eye to eye. Yeah. Like the same things, like to do the same things. And just have fun. Don't take life too seriously and just have fun. Well, they say what? Marry your best friend? <laughs> yes. That's yeah. good. Yeah. yeah. Well, you guys do have such a beautiful family. And I loved the post that you guys recently made on social media of Jackson uh, being done with preschool, which is crazy. Yeah. Where has the time gone? But how, how do you love it? He loves school, right? He loves school. He goes, yeah, he went two days a week. Um, he only went two days a week. And he, I think, every morning would ask like am yeah. i going to school today like he only went for three hours yeah he loved it yeah first experience in school so he he was pretty excited was about it he had you know his best friend is in his class and his teacher was fantastic so yeah it was, it was nice that's great to hear what are your guys's summer plans with the whole fam uh we got a, a sun river a central oregon trip coming up here um we're gonna stick, I think, pretty like closer to home than maybe we do in most summers yeah. this year. Like we're hoping to take little we live an hour and a half from the beach and an hour and a half from the mountains. So we'll probably just take day trips, little trips here and there. Yeah, we just did Arizona. Um so yeah, not not too many plans this summer. Yeah. A lot of family time though. I and also maybe a, a, a wedding coming up for your mom. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, God. yeah, yeah, a lot of family time. Yeah, my mom's getting married in August here. Mm -hmm. um, I guess I, I don't look at that as like a trip or anything, but yeah, a plan. Um, so yeah, she'll be getting married here in the end of August. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm sure that will consume a lot of the that month. I love it. Will that wedding be televised? Have they decided yet? I, I think so, yeah. I think... Um, stay tuned. Yeah, stay tuned. But they're pretty <laughs> everyone's pretty excited for it. I know, because we've all been there every step of the way. It's like, okay, yeah. we got we to gotta see the actual wedding now. Yeah, <laughs> I think everyone's pretty excited about that. So, I'm, I'm, yeah, it's going to be fun. How great will it be to have the whole family together to, to celebrate such a joyous occasion? Uh, yeah, no, it'll be great having the whole family. Um, my sister doesn't live in town, neither does my brother, my youngest brother. Um, so yeah, everyone will be coming back into the fold. Um, and yeah, weddings are just fun. You see family, like my a lot of my mom's family don't live here. Yeah. So you'll be and seeing- Chris's family, we kind of yeah, meet Yeah, never family. met Chris's side of things, family, friends, really. So, um, and this is Chris's first wedding too. Like this is his, you know, so yeah, you know, it's gonna be exciting for him. Like this is his first experience yeah. getting married. Um, so yeah, it's just gonna be fun, I think all around. Will the kids be involved? I could see little Lila being like a flower girl. Maybe. Ah. Yeah, I was gonna say, you might, we might, you might see more of that. You gotta tune yeah, in. Yeah, you gotta tune in. I feel, this... I feel like Jackson's gonna turn it into his own thing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Honestly though, it's gonna be, yeah. We're gonna have to rein it in. Like, this yeah. is Mimi's day, not your yeah. day. Him, him <laughs> and his cousin, Ember. Yeah. They both, I feel like, are gonna do some stealing. Everyone is here for me. Yeah, they're, they're, they're going to do, they're gonna do some <laughs> stealing that day. It's yeah. a really cool thing for, for fans to be able to be along with you guys for the rides, the highs, the lows, everything in between. And, you know, it made me think about how there's another royal family on TV, the Kardashians, who decided this year was time to call yeah. it quits after two decades of showing their lives for everyone to see on, on TV. When will you guys know it's time to wrap? Oh, that's... I think that like the, the minute it's not fun anymore. I think for us, like we're, we're we enjoy sharing our lives and, you know, for, for right now, our kids get along great with the crew and it's fun. And the minute it's not fun anymore, I think that's, you know, then you kind of got to come together and be like, all right, so what, what's, what's our next step, I guess. 